Assalamu alaikum. Today I will be talking on uh, aerodynamic study. First, uh, definition of aerodynamic study. What is aerodynamics? We need to um, understand it first before going to aerodynamic study. Uh, because aerodynamics is a process that occurs in our body. Uh, in our body, there are other uh, dynamics like hemodynamics through the heart. Uh, CSF also has a dynamics in uh, different ventricles. Like uh, similarly, uh, uh, urine has a dynamics. It produces in the uh, collecting system, then it transported, actively transported, um, 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 like a bolus, actively transported, transported to the bladder. And um, uh, there, uh, it needs a pressure gradient to um, to um, uh, go into the bladder from the ureter. And uh, um, gradually, uh, uh, when urine um, keep uh, going into the bladder, and bladder uh, relaxes according to the um, volume of the urine. But uh, there is no significant increase in the detrusor pressure because um, if um, pressure increase then emptying of ureter into the urinary bladder will be difficult and uh, gradually uh, kidney may get hydronephrosis. So um, uh, transport of the urine through the uh, ureter is also active process and storage of urine into the urinary bladder also an active process and periodic evacuation of the urine from the urinary bladder is also obviously an active process. So what is aerodynamics? Aerodynamics means transport of urine through the upper tract and uh, uh, storage in the urinary bladder and periodic evacuation through the uh, bladder and urethra is called aerodynamics. That is transport, uh, storage and evacuation of urine through the urinary tract is called aerodynamics. Aerodynamics has two parts, upper tract aerodynamics and lower tract aerodynamics. Obviously, uh, you know. And when we want to know the problem in the urinary, uh, either transport or storage or evacuation, that study is called aerodynamic study. So aerodynamic study has two parts. Upper tract aerodynamic study is called Whittaker test and lower part urinary uh, aerodynamics study has uh, five parts. One is systematic gradually filling and uh, studying different parameters are, um, um, is called uh, systometry and when we allow detrusor muscle to contact voluntarily it starts voluntarily but uh, contact uh, involuntarily uh, is pressure flow study uh, we study uh, tone or contraction or state of uh, sphincter muscle, external sphincter muscle is called um, EMG external sphincter electromyography and there is pressure flow study as uh, there is uh, pressure, uh, urethral pressure profilometry um, and another one is video aerodynamics. These are components of different components of uh, lower tract aerodynamics. Thank you very much.